Hey, what's up guys, this is Demon AX coming at you with a new video. My angle's a little off here, but I'm, it's fine, I'm going to be placing... You're going to see the freeze frame of the uh, initial like, vid. Uh, so I'm reacting to the Pokemon Direct that came out today. Luckily I did a total social media blackout today. I didn't look it up. I didn't let like anyone try to fucking, hey, yeah, you wanna see you wanna see this Pokemon Direct or her hair nails news back from it? Well I got news for you. I literally blocked everyone who tried that shit with me today. Literally blocked everyone. <laughs> now, we're gonna watch this. Well, I'm gonna watch it. You probably already, if you're watching this, you probably already watched it yourself. So let's begin. And oh. welcome to Pokemon Direct. I'm Ishihara from the Pokemon Company. Today, I would like to provide the latest news about the Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield games. To begin, please take a look at this video. Video. Oh, damn! What the fuck's that? Is that a rival? Oh my god, that's adorable. What the hell's going on? What the hell? Is that a turtle? A sheep and I have no idea. I'm drinking this song. Wait, what? What? No. No. They put the Pokemon Go rates? Okay. Okay. So. Okay. Oh. That guy looked like. Hello, I'm Masuda from Game Freak. Hi, I'm Omori from Game Freak. What did you think of the video? Today, we would like to deliver the latest news on Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield to all of you I'm around the world, to right here from Game Freak's I'm office. I'm still trying to understand who that purple-headed guy was with the cape. I'm assuming that's like a champion because of the whole appearance. You can take on the role of the main character, who resides in the Galar region. After choosing Grookey, Snorkel, oh, or Snorkel as your first partner Pokemon, you will embark on an adventure to become the champion. Your journey will take you through vast and lush grasslands, towns in which you will find humans and Pokemon working together, and many other locations Holy filled crap. with rich personality. Pokemon battles are the most popular form of entertainment in the Galar region. Right. <laughs> Stadium.
stadiums across the Gala region are frequently filled with cheering crowds that have gathered to witness battles between gym leaders and challengers. The excitement of these battles is often broadcast on television in the Gala region yeah. as well. The most exciting part of visiting a new region is, of course, encountering okay. Pokemon that you've never seen before. To tell you more about some of the Pokemon that reside in the Gala region, I'd like to hand it over to James, right, the art he's director from, on these games. Hey, Jamie. He's from England. Hello. I'm James Turner from Game Freak. I worked as the art director for these games. There are a lot of never-before-seen Pokemon that await you okay. in the Gala region. But allow me to introduce you to just a few of them. The first Pokemon I'd like to show you is Wooloo. This Pokemon's defining characteristic is its fluffy fur, which is treasured by weavers in a town in the Gala region who use it to craft popular specialty goods. It's weird, I'm expecting this it to Pokemon evolve here like is a... Gossifler, the flowering Pokemon. I'm expecting the sheep to evolve Gossifler like uh, favors places with Marie Bill and evolve. water, and its pollen oh, is said okay. to have healing properties. This next Pokemon is called Dreadnought. Dreadnought? Pokemon. The sharp and edges of its jaw allow it to bite off chunks Wait, is it a turtle of or a tortoise? and iron. Its vicious nature it makes design it of its feet make it look like a tortoise. For all but the most experienced trainers. This Pokemon that can be seen flying steadily through the sky is called Corviknight. It puts its skills to use when working as a flying taxi which will take the player back to any town he or she oh. previously visited. As many of you already know, some Pokemon can evolve, changing their appearance and becoming stronger in the process. Gossifleur is one of these Pokemon. When Gossifleur evolves... That's drastic. It becomes... Oh, Elder! Right? Elder. As you Elder can Goss, see, Elder. there are now small seeds Okay, so it's going from a young kind of girl to an old woman. Oh, okay, that makes the design make more sense. said to promote growth in plants and can revitalize both people and Pokemon. That's all I can show you this time. Did you show to find new Pokemon in the Gala region go. for you to discover? Of course, you can look forward to finding many Pokemon you're already familiar with. I hope you're as excited as we are to encounter the amazing variety of Pokemon that inhabit the Gala okay, region. Okay, what about the mascots? Don't mean to be an ass, but what about the mascots? Meeting lots of Pokemon is one of the thrills of the adventure. And where you will find the widest variety of Pokemon out of anywhere in the Gala region is in a place called the Wild Area. This wild area stretches between cities and is filled with abundant nature as far as the eye can see. Different Pokemon can appear depending on where you are and what the weather is like. Meaning there will be new discoveries for you each day. So they Some make of it you may already have noticed, but while adventuring through this area, you have control over the camera, allowing you to better search for items. <laughs> okay, so they actually search far and wide in the tall grass. So they did make it open world. And even in the lake, sort of, for you never know what you might find. In certain locations in the Gala region, a new phenomenon can be triggered that makes a Pokemon giant in size and gives it incredible strength. This phenomenon is called Dynamaxing. Dynamaxing okay, opens up new possibilities in the heated battles performed by trainers and their Pokemon. For more details, I would like to turn it over to Iwao, okay. the planning director for the games. Hi, I'm Iwao from Game Freak and the planning director for Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. Hey, man. Yeah. Let me tell you more about the new Dynamax feature, which will surely bring about all new strategies to Pokemon battles. Pokemon from the Gala region can Dynamax to not only become massive in size, but also boost their power. Wait, Max, what? Max Lightning, Max Knuckle? 
all the moves they know turn into powerful maximum. Okay. Dynamaxing can be used once per battle. However, the Pokemon will revert to normal after three turns. So, you need to choose wisely okay. when to trigger it. Mastering Dynamax will be key to becoming a full-fledged Pokemon trainer in these games. Remember that wild area we told you about? If you connect to other players, you'll find more ways to play there. One of these new multiplayer features is called Max Raid Battles, in which four Pokemon trainers okay, can join so forces to battles in here. Max Pokemon. In Max Raid Battles, the wild Dynamax Pokemon keeps its giant form for oh, the fuck. entire battle. Not only that, it also has special powers that make it an extremely formidable opponent. Only one of these four players who have teamed up for the Max Raid Battle will be able to Dynamax their Pokemon in each battle. So coordinating with your team will be crucial when taking on these powerful wild Pokemon. If you and your allies manage to emerge victorious, you will get a chance to capture the Pokemon in a truly dynamic Do we have to do multiplayer on this? The Pokemon that you can take on in Max Raid Battles also vary depending on where you are in the wild area and the state of the weather. Among these different Pokemon are some that can only be caught after you defeat them in Max Raid Battles. So we hope trainers will join forces and test their skills against a variety of Pokemon. So you walked wild Pokemon Max behind Raid these Max Raids. Max Raid cooperative four-player gameplay Freaking against lovely. a single Pokemon, which is a first for the main series of Pokemon games. It's going to be a ton of fun to use your Nintendo Switch system's local wireless functionality to tackle these battles with friends in person and experience the excitement together. You can also connect with other players over the internet to enjoy playing with other trainers from all around the globe. So I hope you'll try Max Raid battles with all sorts of other players. Next, I would like to introduce some of the people you'll encounter on your adventure. This guy is the greatest trainer in the Galar region, and also the current champion. His name is Leon. In a region where Pokemon battles are so widely enjoyed, his undefeated record in official matches is all the more incredible. His popularity is only enhanced by his shining personality, winning him the adoration of trainers across the region. It's no exaggeration to say that he is the most prominent trainer oh, I mean, in all of Galar. He, he has one on the shorts. The champion has a younger brother, who also happens to be one of your rivals. His name is Hop. Hop dreams Hop. to one day become champion, just like his elder brother. And he trains vigorously every day towards this goal. Oh, he's a weaker one. His journey through the Galar region begins on the same day as yours. On your journey, you and Hop will receive a great deal of support from these two characters. Professor Magnolia is the professor of the Galar region and specializes in researching the Dynamax phenomena. Sonia is her granddaughter and also serves as her assistant. Their abundant wisdom and sound advice will surely come in handy throughout your adventure. Okay. Okay. Next, I would like to talk about the Pokemon gyms in the Galar region. You and your rival will need to take on the Pokemon gyms throughout the region in order to achieve your goal of becoming champion. These gym stadiums are constructed in very special locations that allow for Pokemon to be Dynamaxed. The gym leaders also have extremely powerful Dynamax Pokemon on their teams, so you will need to counter them with some of your own. Battles between two Dynamax Pokemon are explosive and will cause the energy and excitement in the stadium to reach its peak. Let me introduce one of the gym leaders to you. This is the grass type Milo. expert, Milo. This gym leader is all about enjoying oh, battles alongside oh, his trustworthy Pokemon. And you will have to overcome his tenacious fighting style to continue. He didn't have a nose for a second there. Look like when you many more heated battles against gym leaders over the course of your adventure. 
We've shown up quite a bit today, but I have one more video I would like you to see. Mascots? Please take a look. Mascots? Mascots. Two Pokemon you saw in the video just now are in fact legendary Pokemon of the Gala region, called Zashian and Zamazenta. Zashian and Zamazenta, okay. Look forward to discovering for yourself just what role Zashian and Zamazenta will play in the story. I hope you enjoyed today's Pokemon Direct. Of course, what we revealed today is just a small part of what you will okay. find in Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. There are many it's more Pokemon playing. and interesting characters for you to discover in the Galar region. We're putting everything we've got here at Game Freak into making Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield a game that everyone around the world will enjoy. Please look forward to it. Thanks to all of our guests from Game Freak. Finally, I would like to announce the release date. Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield will be available on November 15th, 2019 as a global simultaneous release. On the same day, we'll also be offering a dual pack version, which includes the following contents. I hope you will look forward to your new Pokemon adventure in the gallery. Thank oh, you for watching. Oh, 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 music is... Okay. <clears throat> okay. So, I just watched the whole damn video. Okay. I, uh, I'm gonna need some time to formulate my thoughts. I need time to basically bring everything up to par for myself here. Um, with that said, guys, I hope you enjoyed watching my reaction. It's, I'm going to put the whole raw footage, as actually you probably already saw, I'm going to put the whole raw footage. <laughs> you probably saw that I put the whole raw footage, so uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's probably a thing <laughs> already. Um, again, I'm going to try to have the uh, thing here, and hopefully I'm going to get this up very soon, soon as I'm filming this. Um, yeah, so I need, I need to formulate my thoughts, guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Give me a comment. Your should, comments are, should, well, comments should be able. Uh, down below if you want to subscribe please subscribe like honestly it's like it does help and give me the chance to help my channel grow i can get a better sense but i can do more for you guys you know if, if i get more uh, free time for this stuff uh i need to formulate my thoughts uh yeah peace out